finally uh, figured out with uh, opening packs and uh, kind of utilizing them and how they will uh, be like in the loadouts. So I have uh, added some things off camera to complete my loadout. And now there's a um, little bit more increases on some things here. Um, definitely that speed is up a lot more. That's going to help a lot. Um, right now, it's a little bit feelings on the downside. Some of that stuff with pitching is too, but once I get the correct um, perks, really, it's a get. I mean, you know, that stuff's just log the drop pack, so really once I get better ones, then I can apply that toward my pitching loadout. So for now, uh, this is really how things are looking. Spark plug power control, just kind of keep that all around. Uh, pitching, though, this one's a little bit different. Since I really don't have too much to really choose from, I figured I'll go ahead and do speed in terms of, you know, at least be able to, like, get to the ball a little quicker. Still kept fielding to... This one, I just kind of just mess around with a little bit. Because this one's more like pinch hitting, so. That's really just the way everything looks here. So, alright, got Linsanity already activated. So, we're just going to go ahead and get ourselves going. Took me a little bit figuring out, but. Like toward the end of the last video, but then once this I did, I'm good. Appeals to his hitters to be more discerning of the play. Also, in the last episode, I got my first home run, and look at this pitching. Just minimize the damage. Shut down the opposition. Was that just 2 1? He'll be appearing in his third game this season. Number 24. What? Stepping in once again is Billy McKinney. He bounced out last Wow. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. McKinney. Good swing. Just got Jesus Christ. That one out. Lindsay. Only 20 years old, he was selected in the third round back in the 2021 MLB Draft. Hey, this guy hasn't reached the big leagues yet, but he's coming. You're going to know his name at some point. He just got a few more developmental things to work on. Nope, Ball one. There. And think about it. In game hey, one of this series, they've already had to go deep into their bullpen. This could affect them for the rest of the weekend if they don't get really good starting pitching. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. And we're going to have a quick stoppage here as a beach ball has made its way into right field. What the hell? <laughs> now nah, I'm going to curve all down low. He's going to want another fastball. Tough curve yeah. ball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Now, let's mess with him. To two balls and two strikes now. I know he missed with a fastball right there, but this guy's arsenal. You can't figure out what he's trying to do. He's got a lot of different directions he could go in right here. Did well Look at that bat here. There as he spoils off a good changeup. Bring it on. Ground ball sent back up the middle. What? Find its way into How the hell field. it go by everybody? Wow, talk about having a pretty special game. That's his third single of the game, Dero. Three for four. Nah. Not a bad game. Yeah, just not trying to do too much, Dan. <laughs> Taking what the pitcher's giving him right here. Oh, a diving effort as it's off his glove. But they will not get it out on the play as he beats the throw to first, and there are two. I know it's not my now. pitching. will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Back, and the runner back in standing. 
first delivery to him. Oh, that pitch is out. Oliva is a guy that can really pick him up and put him down, if you will. He's a plus runner and really uses speed to his advantage in multiple Pride. ways on the field. Yeah, and it works for him. It works for him in a lot of ways, like you said, Matty. Hits the ball on the ground. He has the potential to beat it out. I can't tell you what this does for an infield or an outfield defense to be put on their toes and have to make plays against this guy. The count now at two and one. McKinney at second. Deglin on at first with nobody out. Three and one. Now. What? Eduardo Garcia will be next. Oh Lord, it's gonna be one of those games. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Get to it. A range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. And a daring move there pays off as he'll make it into third on the fly ball to left. Now Henry Silva. Yeah, that wasn't really that good of a relief effort. Always nice to get the first game of the series, but even more so when it's in front of the home crowd. It seems to energize everybody the rest of the series. And tonight's ends at a six. That definitely finish. wasn't that good. I got into a little trouble. I'm kind of glad they pulled me. Minor League Baseball on the show. It wasn't that like I allowed anything, like as far as runs, but I didn't help anything really. To get underway. Here comes the first baseman. I was only able to get one out. Liner toward right center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Hey, right here, anytime the leadoff hitter gets on in front of the pitcher, it puts. And now in the box, Jamie Lindsay. He singled in his first AB. Now here it comes. Lindsay. Line towards center field. Dang. Goodwin is there, and he has it for the first out. Next, here is Jamie Lindsay. If it's slow like that, I need a contact swing. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Bounce to first. Dang it. it cleanly, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. The idea was there, the execution wasn't. So now into the box is Jamie Lindsay grounded out in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double play is oh, in order. I wish. on the ground the way this defense is, they could certainly I freaking wish. McKinney will have plenty of room as he makes the catch, and there's a big out. One run game this afternoon, three to two. Yeah, right now I'm just gonna be kind of having around the 250 batting mark. I mean, maybe I get lucky and get called to the bigs, you know, end of this year. I don't know. I mean, it's it's really hard telling. It is really hard to tell. Whoa, why am I? Okay, I don't think I did that. I can swear I didn't. Let's say like select loadout. It any squid doing that? I don't know. All right, so I'm at 62 overall. Obviously, this is the best one for me in the current moment. Yeah, stability 35. I need to get that increased. I'll try and get it to like maybe 37, 38 at the end of the year. Okay, there we go. Uh, I don't know why I've been getting kind of screwed with when it comes to this stuff. I don't know why. Minor 
League Baseball is live and on the... You're out. I'm batting fifth. Digging in next, hey, Jamie Lindsay. Let's go, drive it. The first base. Come on, kid, get off for it. Here we go. Lindsay. First offering on its way. The offensive game plan today is certainly to see the ball up. This guy is known on the mound for sinker changeup combination. He's going to try and establish down in the zone to get swing and a miss or ground balls consistently. You have to find something above the belt to get loose on. The 0 1 pitch. Oh, right. Oh, my goodness. Second for one on the first to complete the double play. The goal was high, but I just wasn't on target with it. And now here is Jamie Lindsay. The base knock to the outfield could score the tying run from second. They spot First here. Pitch on its way. The but being so early with that. Right here, because they certainly can tell from their dugout. This guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. Ooh, 87 mile an hour slider? Montano over at second. Ramirez on at first with two down. Rounded weekly. God dang it. All right, come on, baby. Move, move, and the two out threat won't pay off. The inning is over. Mm. Next to stand in is Jamie Lindsay, over two on his line thus far. First pitch on its way. Get back up the middle. All right. And it's through into center field, base hit. Why wouldn't you go? And the runner at third will put the brakes on here as they didn't want to chance it even with two. Unless they still scored him. Ready to begin the eighth. Yeah, next to battle be the first baseman, Jamie Lindsay. He start having multi-hit games now. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Slow little. That's the not third. the way to do it. Reined in. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. I mean, if I can get a little bit hit streak, that's cool too. I can tell I'm kind of going nowhere right now with the way that this stuff is going. I'm not liking it. Actually, I'll be right back. Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Today, it's the second of this three-game series between the Memphis Redbirds and the Durham Bulls. It's baseball. It's the show, and it comes your way next. Ramirez, the Dominican left-hander, will get the nod to start here. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, I'm really excited to watch this guy in this one. He strung together a solid season up to this point. ERA in the low twos, and that's not an easy thing to do in this day and age of high-scoring games and home runs and teams filled with guys that get hit throughout the lineup. This is a really good pitcher. So here is hey, Jamie pitch, Lindsay. The first baseman. Jamie Lindsay. First offering on its way. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Dan Dero, we take a look at our home nine as they take the field here today. Four and two over the last six games, including a win last All right, time. I'm out. back. Yeah, Maddie, the first game of any series is super important. You have a chance to set the tone, whether it's three game set or a four game set. You take the first one, you put that other team on their heels. I'm going to take it. Eight, one and two. I didn't want that. And he swings and pops it foul behind the plate. <laughs> and he'll get under it to put it away in foul territory. And that ends the inning.
Yet I freaking swung at the other one. Now at the plate, here is Jamie. But I kind of had no choice because it was, yeah. Probably gonna be a call strike three. Pitch. And it's fouled away. Oh, and one count and the pitch. That's back toward the mound. This Shoot. will be a tough turn, however, to second for one. Relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is Why retired. am I so chasing? Next, it'll be Jamie Lindsay. The first baseman. Jamie Lindsay. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. Grounded down the third baseline. He's got it. Come on. On to first, oh. and it's a quick start to the seventh, as now there are two away. And definitely worth another look with our show track data. Great reaction from the hot corner to make the backhand stop, and then he. Hey, no. Some more good work out of the bullpen as he notches his 10th save of the season right there. Nice job. A one-run game this afternoon, 3-2 the final finish. No errors. They left four men on bay. Team's future stars are on. I might think about changing the pitching load out on that main one. So the next to bat will be Jamie Lindsay. Because I really don't need fielding first attributes that badly. This is on the ground over to first. Fielded cleanly. And a step on first for the out. Three unassisted. Almost had on that sweeping curve. Now with the plate is Jamie Lindsay. He bounced out last time up. For me, this is an important add-on inning here. Their little lead is cute. I like it, but keeping the pressure on, building that lead, that's how you bury someone. There we go. Into center field, line drive base hit. So it's a base knock to lead off their half of the fourth. I mean, there's no secret right now. There's a fight at the bat rack. Now I get another one. Now to the plate, here is Jamie Lindsay, singled in his last at bat. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard. Well, the side is retired as they make the play. So no runs here on a base hit. No. And now, Jamie Lindsay. And now a pitch on the way. Oh, are you kidding me? And there's out number two. They came back and tied it. Next up, Jamie Lindsay. He's one for four so far. Jamie Lindsay. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. High fly oh man, that dude didn't even have to move. There and they go down in a hurry here as this side is quickly retired. Hey, it took them an extra frame to do it, but hey. One for five. I just have to keep getting that contact up. Well, I'm getting increasingly impatient about this player's status. He hasn't been called up yet. I think he's ready. I can't wait to see what he does when he gets there. Let's talk about what he has to look forward to. Sean Casey's with me. Case, walk us through what it was like for you that first game in the major leagues. What was it like for you? Oh my gosh. I still remember my my first um my first at bat was in Chicago. I remember they said, you're going to pinch hit for Dave Justice. So I go in and pinch hit, and I look up, and there's the 40,000 people in the stands. Uh, yeah. You know, all of a sudden, the anxiety was at a different level. And I think the <laughs> third deck, that third level, you don't have that. You don't have that in the minor leagues where you're like, wow, there's an upper deck here. It's crazy. And I think visually, it's, it's overwhelming. I know for me it was. I ended up getting a hit in my first at bat, but I remember those thoughts of, wow, this is, this is a different ballgame. This is a different feeling up here. So there's something to be said about a player that gets called up, getting used to all the things that go on uh, in the big leagues. 
Well, I'm glad they, they still have faith in me because I've been slumping. But, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm hanging in there. So it's about just, you know. Just flew. When it rains, it pours. Next up is Jamie Lindsay, the first baseman. Jamie Lindsay. All right, what's that? Right here. First pitch on its way. Weak grounder down the line at third. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. Hit on the ground toward the left. Reined in. One there. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. So one run on two. Been hitting into a gazillion double plays lately. Ready now is Jamie Lindsay. Here's the first pitch to him. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. Frey. swing here on the pitch inside but it's a full swing in the eyes of the home plate umpire strike two a swing and a oh my god what am I what zone. was I There's looking at I think that's one of the toughest calls for an umpire to make the check swing appeal next to hit is Jamie Lindsay no hits in three tries so far he struck out once he's ready here's the first pitch hit hard back finally and that gets through for a one out base I go throw to third and he will make it around no way I was about to say and he'll get in there safely that was a risk. Sometimes the first pitch is the best pitch you'll see all at bat. Definitely coming out of his shoes. Aggressive style. First pitch. Yeah, that's what you want to do when you're playing on the road. Take it right to the home squad and get a win. Now the pressure is off. If they get Current series has ended. I'm probably going to get benched. Three. I really need to work the counts a lot more. I really do. I need to start working those counts. Let's uh, go ahead and, yeah. Durability and stamina increases. An agent checks in with a client currently in the miners. Could be better. Not gonna lie. He kind of said the same thing like before. All right.
love in the streets. Also, there wasn't no love in my home, so only get love when it's coming from me. I really don't want to be with the Cardinals. You know, this is time for baseball of the minor. It's like literally the worst situation for me. I want to be the Diamondbacks. I want to be the Royals. Uh, Pirates. Uh, like, now the first pitch. I wouldn't even mind the Padres. I think that would be cool. With Fernando Tatis. Ball two as the breaking ball misses inside. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Find the ball, find the ball, and that's into the, the outfield for a one-out base hit. Count leverage right there, sitting dead red fastball, and he didn't miss it. Perfect S pitch, timing everything there. So now here is Jamie Lindsay looking to put them ahead early with this at bat. Lindsay. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Count one and, oh. and this one's down off the shoe tops. One and oh. <laughs> to short. Scooped up. Dig, dig, and there's dig, one dig, down dig, now. Dig, dig. Three. Keep it. Stepping in, Jamie Lindsay grounded out in his last at bat. Jamie This is hit high in the air out towards the right center. McKinney's there for it. He's got it, and there are two down now. Battery low. My controller here. Let's plug this in. Don't deal with any issues. Okay. I'm charging up. Stepping up is. Jamie Lindsay. He flew out in his last day beer. First pitch coming. Here it is. Lifted in the air to straightaway center. Waiting on it is Goodwin. No problem with this one. And the inning is over. It's yeah, a run right now. My batting average isn't that great. Always nice to get the first game of the series. But even more You're so going 250 in the minor leagues. You're in it. Beyond carved up in the bigs. Thank you for putting me in a release spot. I really appreciate that. I really do. Come on and make his fourth appearance in this campaign. Number 24, Jamie Lindsay. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And next to battle will be the first baseman, David Fry. The first baseman. And the pitch. As we near the end of this one, it's clear the long ball has played a big role in today's outcome. Dan, d -Row, what are your final thoughts on what we've seen? Yeah, just non-competitive pitches in some big situations, Dan. And the are you for real? You know, d -Row, one of the oh, things my God. Have location, and it was obvious in this one today that the pitchers weren't on point. And what happens when that happens? Hitters make you pay, and the long ball was a big part of this one here. That'll bring up Billy McKinney as he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. Curveball close, but it's one and one. Now a spin and a throw back to second and a dive, but he's back in there. He's set. Here comes the one one. That's the ball. A runner at second, nobody out. Let's do something different. Even count, two balls and two strikes. He didn't expect that. Oh, crud. the letters with the fastball that time. That was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on two and two, but when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's oh, obviously boy. easy to take that one. Catch made in straightaway center as the runner tags from second. Next to dig in, Kellen Deglin. He's 0 for 2 with a walk thus far. As he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. 
Props to the hitter right there for laying off with a guy on third. You want to be aggressive, but you have to get a pitch you can drive. 2-0 now. You never know. Oh my god! As he arrives at second without a play, as a run will score on the play as well. Jared Oliva will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Dan, that's a huge insurance run right there. Has to feel good as a hitter right there to not only get a ribby knock, but to give your team a little bit of breathing. It, it does, and it makes your pitcher go out there with a little bit more free and easy frame of mind instead of going in a 1-1 game where every pitch is so important. You're one pitch away from a solo tying the game up. That's not the case now. He's got it. Throw on to first, two gone. All right. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Eduardo Garcia trying to add some padding to their lead in the form of that run standing out there at second base. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Well, I did allow a run, but that was a rare time that I ever did. Always nice to get the first game of the series, but even more so when it's in front of a home crowd. It seems to energize everybody the rest of the series. A 6-4 to four finish in tonight's affair. That's okay. Welcome to MLB the show in this That's okay. Next it'll be Jamie Lindsay. The first baseman. Here's the first pitch. Lindsay. Line towards center field. And that finds the outfield in front of him. for a base hit. Even though that pitcher was able to execute in off the plate batter was able to keep his hands inside that baseball and drive it up the middle. So now to the plate, Jamie Lindsay. He collected a base hit his first time up. From the belt, kicks and deals. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Fisher's under it. And that ends the inning. One hit, one left. So next to hit is Jamie Lindsay. And guys, seventh yeah, inning already. Hey, I'm not complaining, but this one's been flying by. Yeah, I'll agree with that, Matt. That's what you get when both starting pitchers Ooh. have been working. Neither of them have been nibbling around the strike zone at all, and they've trusted their defense to make the plays, and they've done just that. Yeah, and it's resulted in a game that could really go either way in these late in. Now to the plate, Jamie Lindsay. Two hits and three at bats for him in this one. Man, no finally I've had strike. a multi hit game. The wind up and the 1 1. one. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't yeah, quite ball, catch the strike. bottom of the zone. Hey, let's go, big fella. He's right here. Sent out to straightaway center field. Fisher's under it. And that ends the inning. Nothing across here this half. And that one run held up tonight. Finally a multi-hit game. Finally, 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 finally. going on this hitting coach is looking to get more out of one of his sluggers I'm trying it's hard when you have such a freaking itsy bitsy tiny PCI
future stars are on. At the plate now is Jamie Lindsay, who did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. Here's the first pitch to him. Owen won the count. Rasmussen has tossed over 30 innings so far this season and has an ERA he'd like to see come down a bit. Starts the day in the high fours. Lofted in the air Dang. toward right center. Oliva is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. If I can do that again, that'd be nice. Now it'll be Jamie Lindsay, 0 for 1 here in the early going. We set, here it comes. This is in the air out to right field. Okay. Catch is made here in right, and here comes the runner from third. Oh, yeah. And they are on the board with the sack fly as this is now a 2-1 to one game. That was a good controlled swing out of him there, and that's exactly what he was hoping for. Digging in will be Jamie Lindsay. Drove in a run with a sack fly last time up. Swing and a miss on a ball out of the zone. Hey, if I'm on the mound, I'm going even further out of zone on this next pitch. Weekly hit sure. third. Field it cleanly and quickly. There are two away. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And here comes the first baseman, Jamie Lindsay. That will be great. From the stretch. Hit out towards uh. second. And quickly, there's one down to lead off the front. Now I'm having right, right around like 50 seed. Hey, this was a pretty tightly played game. Got a little bit of everything in this one. Some timely hitting, runs on the board, key pitching, and defense in certain spots. This one was a fun one to watch. Minor League Baseball is live and on the air. Ow. So here's the cleanup hitter, Jamie Lindsay. The first baseman, Jamie Lindsay. First pitch on its way. Sent oh my the God. The second, reined in. They'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. I'm trying to do too much. I need to not be thinking about it so much. In next, Jamie I'm like getting dragged down and it's just spiraling out of control right now. First pitch of the AB on its way. Tried to check it in its own one. Just keeps spiraling more. Just something like that keeps happening. This is just, this is ugly. Ready with the 0-1. I got one ball, one strike. Hey! Hey, usually the second ball, time through strikes. the order, yeah, you start gotcha. seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating and feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. -to -back. Breaking pitch, and this bounces in front of the catcher. Now two and two, two on, two out. This is when you have to make a pitch right here. The last thing you want to do is run the count full to three and two. Then the runners are going to be off to the races. I got three and two. And he well. with this one up around the noggin. Now it's full. Right here. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a three-two change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible to hit. Now oh, a, a walk. No swing, says the home plate umpire. Ooh. Not even an appeal. It's and that's two free passes in the third inning alone. So you have to wonder if maybe it's something mechanical or if it's just psychological. Got to get back on track here. Into the box. 
Jamie Lindsay. He's batting cleanup in this one, but will get us started here in the inning as they look to wake up the bats. Yeah, not much to get excited about with just a single notch on the scoreboard, but you have to give credit to where it's deserved. The pitching on the other side has been really impressive. Watch this for is a waste. Uh... Pencils these guys in, in the middle of the order. Big spot. Time for them to get back in this game with a couple quality ABs. The 1 1 home is yeah. taken for strike two. Someone on this offense needs to take it upon themselves to have a quality AB and start the line moving again. Swung on and missed. He didn't even come close to contact on a ball way out of the zone. One out. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Jamie Lindsay. Two away. That's trying to strike out a little bit here. This isn't good. Yeah, they don't have a lot of outs left to work with, so it's time for someone to make something happen if they're going to get back into this thing. Ball one to start the at bat. Start guessing out here. The 1 0 home is taken for ball two. If you've been paying attention, the guy on the mound does not want to come inside. If I'm at the plate, I'm leaning out over. Two and one to count. I guess the right pitch, just not location. As a look, now the pitch. Shoot! You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be laid on that fastball. The 2 2. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors in a man. Left. That is actually my first ever multi strikeout game. You might think it's just another win, but it's awfully hard. Shoot, man. God dang. It has been a rough stretch for him lately. A lot of young players tend to have a reality check those first few times they run into some struggles in the pros. Mike Lowell is with us. Mike, how did you deal with it when you faced adversity as a minor leaguer? Well, I, I tried to focus on the times where I felt good. I felt like the mental part of the game was, was so important that I tried to, whether it was that old school video work that maybe your video guy had in the minor leagues, going back to those at-bats where you know you were swinging the bat well and not necessarily looking at your mechanics, but more thinking about how good did I feel at the plate? How good was I seeing the ball? I remember in A-ball, I had a stretch. I was four for 40, and I just couldn't understand why the team, it looked like there was nine outfielders and 12 infielders playing at the same time. But I, I had to bank on the work that I was putting in, the preparation, and it's such a long season that everyone's probably gonna run into one, maybe two bad stretches. It's what can you do during that to get yourself out of that bad stretch as quick as possible. And once you get into that good stretch, how can we maintain that good stretch as long as possible? So I think preparation and hard work are two main keys, but just, you can't get too frustrated. You gotta understand that you're here for a reason. You've made it because you have the talent. We just gotta be able to put it together. That's very true. Very, very true. I got the sound. Just gotta stay strong. Stay strong. Keep getting that durability up. I can do this. I'll be okay.
to hit Jamie Lindsay. The first baseman. First pitch of the inning on its way. Oh, and you look at a fastball that doesn't miss by a whole lot. It's one and all. Hey, like you can up there, kid. Huh? That evens it up, one and one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. That hook stayed up in the zone. You can see he struggled with that curveball early. He's trying to find that release point with his off-speed pitches. Let's see if he can find the feel for that thing moving forward. One out, nobody on. Heading out towards shallow right. And he will make the play out there. And Got there time it better than that. Out. Got time it better. I'll square it up on it. Now to bat, Jamie Lindsay flew out last time up. The first baseman. He's set and the pitch. Breaking okay. ball that time that misses out of the zone. I love everything this pitcher's got working right now. He's got presence. He's got great body language on the mound. He's got fastball command and a nice early feel for his off-speed stuff. Now the 2-0. 3 and 0 oh now. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with a bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. 3-1. and one. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. -back. Full count. Full count, 3-2. and two. This has popped up. Wow. Round it, round it, find the ball. In there, a base hit. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one-out single. You know, it's funny, the first two strikes... I got a way with one. Now at the plate, Jamie Lindsay got hit in two tries so far. But I kind of had a swing. First pitch of the A-B now. On a rope to the second baseman. And the runner gets back. No double play. Three. Up next, Jamie Lindsay. The first baseman. Jamie Lindsay. Come on. I'm set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Strike one to start the at bat. This is why the manager pencils these guys in in the middle of the order. Big spot. Time for them to get back in this game with a couple quality ABs. Ready with the nothing and one pitch. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. No one out with a runner at second. And this one's in the dirt. Good job there as the count goes to one and two. In the dirt here, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. The 2-2. Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. A runner at second, nobody out. Little target. Staying on alive, that swing staying alive. Well wide at first. Four foul balls in this AB. Pitcher cannot find anywhere to go to put this guy away. Another 2 2 offering. Fastball, strike three, and there's the first out of the inning. Great spot of that 2 2 fastball. You can't place it. A 6 to 4 finish in tonight's affair. Durham wrote an important sixth Here inning to victory in this one. I thought he was going to go low on me. He didn't. They left six men on Welcome to MLB The Show in this pre. Well, you know, like outside of the zone. So runners in scoring position, and here is Jamie Lindsay looking to put them ahead early with this at bat. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. 
swing and a liner. Ciani is there as he makes the catch, and they'll tightrope out a. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And here comes the first baseman, Jamie Lindsay. This is where the pressure starts to build a little bit on an offense. It's not okay. late enough. I mean, you don't have to start panicking right now. But this is where you're looking for someone to light a spark to get back in this game. Boy, Hero, it's about time they got something brewing here. Now into the box. Jamie Lindsay, runner in scoring position with two guys. Need to get some multi-hit games. First pitch on the way. Hit to short. Well, that's not going to do it. Get, 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 get Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Come on. Stepping in once again is Jamie Lindsay, trying here to plate the tying run from second. Let it fly now. Come on, sit on something right here. Let it fly. Now the first pitch. Counts one and oh. Had a slight bit of lag. This is a tough situation to be on the mound, but the key here is minimizing. They're up by two, so if he could find a way to get out of this bases loaded jam by only giving up one run, that would be clutch. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Nowhere to put anybody. 2 0 count. Not a good spot to be in as a pitcher. Hey, keep it going up there. Your turn, your turn. Outside, 3-0 oh, now. A walks as good as a hit. a late rally, and listen to this on, crowd John, now. They are really into this. Good drive. Looking good. Going better up there. Here you go. Now this is no! Going to the second. Is he going to get out of this? Over the first. He does get out of it, and the inning is over. So they load the bases on just one hit, but three... Well, the skipper has to be pleased. They go on the road and win the first two of this three-game series. Playing for the sweep tomorrow. And tonight's ends is a 3 nothing shutout you win. got to be freaking kidding me. Time for baseball of the minor league. Stepping in is. Hey guys, Mark DeRosa here. Welcome to the show. Jamie Lindsay, two hits and eight tries for the series. First offering. Max out everything for full experience. Ah. And he'll flip on to first to record the out. And now in the box, Jamie Lindsay grounded out in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double that was squared up order. really well. On, the way on. this defense is, they could certainly roll too. And this one scoots on. all the way to the wall. Kinkle rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he's safe at the there plate. There we go. And they now lead by two. Well, this is a lesson for all those pitchers out there. When you allow... And now here is Jamie Lindsay, one for two with a double on his line thus far. High and deep down the left field line. <laughs> oh, that could have been a home run. High in the air down the right field line. Ruffner is there to put it away for route number one. It's gonna be kind of just you know more just seeing like what more do I need to keep focusing on next here is obviously durability right now that way I can keep myself on the field a little bit longer in order to have more opportunities to do some damage there's a breaking ball but it's laid off and doesn't find the zone
Rounded back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. God go damn. Back for one. On to first, and they turn the double play. Okay, we're one. Four nothing to score this afternoon. One for four, though. I'm like basically just hovering right around that 240, 250 batting line. That's not good. Take out one game, first phase. Minor League Baseball is live and on the air on the show. Three. So now into the box is Jamie Lindsay. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Now the pitch. Hit on the ground out to short. He's got it. Hard 90, hard 90. The throw to first beats him easily and the side is retired. Nothing doing here in the opening half inning. Digging in next. Jamie Lindsay, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Now the first pitch. He's already walked two in this inning already. This guy just can't seem to find the strike zone. The 1 0 home is taken for ball two. Yeah, I think it's pretty clear they don't want to challenge this guy right here, but working around a guy can come back to bite you at times. Slow roller Shoot. left side. Reined in. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Him, two down. So here is Jamie Lindsay, 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. First pitch of the AB now. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Siani is there now. Way too shallow. Too Look at that. That freaking throw. Was on the money. Now at the plate, here is Jamie Lindsay. Flew out last time up. First pitch on the way. Swing and a liner. There we go. And he'll break through with a solid knock here. His first of the ball game. Check the outfitter now. See where they're at. One run finish today, five to four. I'm still only like getting freaking like one hit a game. Well, five strikeouts. See how far up I am on the line. Oof. Second to last right now. And I got a first baseman ahead of me. That's not.